Hi, friends. Um, a guy was lied to, okay? It's cold. We moved south for a few reasons, okay? Okay? And one of them was is we wanted to get away from cold weather. Now, it's not anything like up north. But golly, when you don't plan for it because you don't think it's going to be this cold, bub, let me tell you. It's cold, and we didn't plan for it. Uh, <clears throat> not by any stretch of imagination did we plan for this cold of weather. Me and the wife both are hunting and searching for coats and stuff. And, oh my goodness. My nephew locked the keys in the car, and there's an extra key in his dad's camper, but his dad's camper key is on his car keys. Here's a prime example of why you don't put all your eggs in one basket. If you got extra keys, don't keep them all together, because that's dumb. <sighs> Moses, it's cold. The guy was lied to. Look at all the snow on the ground out here. We're in south central Kentucky. Last week it was 70 degrees, and today it's 26. <sighs> I'm mad. <sighs> Any who's the way. How are y'all doing today? Guy's got some errands to run. Got my crying out of the way. I just, I don't like the cold. I wanted away from it. Uh, guy's got a couple errands he's got to run. He's got to take some shirts over to uh, the Stitch place. Uh, get some shirts fixed up for him. And I got to go to the storage unit and find the big easy, uh, the big long pink thing um, to get into my nephew's car get the keys out of it which doesn't help that it's 26 degrees but other than that I gotta run uh, I gotta go somewhere to get some Red Bulls and um, what else I gotta do I gotta go to the both storage units I gotta find a, a space heater at one storage unit and then on the way back stop and grab a, the other storage unit and get the big easy out but other than that yeah make sure I got my keys open other than that it's just kind of a chill day uh, not a whole lot else going on. South Central Kentucky. I, I just, I didn't know it got this. When I looked up stuff and I asked around, oh, you know, it gets into the 30s and 40s during the day. Overnight, you're in the 20s, but it warms back up. In the 30s and 40s, I'm good with, fellas and fellas. Okay? 30s and 40s, I can deal with, no problem. To me, that's blue jeans and a t shirt. Maybe even shorts if you're getting into the 40s. This 26 degrees nonsense and snow on the ground. That stuff is not supposed to be in South Central Kentucky. Let me tell you. Okay? <laughs> I was lied to. Hey, look at the moo cow. Brr. <laughs> Just, you know... So any who's and way, don't forget where. <sighs> kind of a chill day today. Yesterday was a chill day, didn't do a whole lot. Uh, what did I do? Laid around, watched some TV, just kind of relaxed, did a little schoolwork on the old laptop. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah. Today, kind of the same thing. Just got a couple errands I got to go run and. I just, <clears throat> then when summer rolls around, it's going to be so hot we can hardly stand it. How much you want to go? It's all right. It doesn't matter. It is what it is. Nose is running. Why? 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 This guy is driving in the middle of the road. There you go, bub. Anyways, so, I don't know, eh, just one of them days, I guess. Got a couple errands to run, gonna go do them, and that's gonna be probably about it. But, just wanted to share this lovely snow with you guys from South Central Kentucky.
there's lots of hills and hollers and hee haws and seesaws down here, so I hope you don't get dizzy or get motion sickness. But we're going to get some footage of the snow on the ground because that's uncommon for down here. It's nothing like the snowpocalypses we have up north, and I'm thankful for that. But oh, They shut everything down down here. If, it's, uh, if it ices up, if it snows on the actually sticks on the ground they just shut it all down because they don't have the equipment down here I was shocked yesterday to actually see at the Wally World snow shovels because I didn't think that they sold that kind of stuff down here but they do oh, I am cold but anywho some way enjoy the view this is some straight up bullshit I just need a space heater. I'm going to have to probably dump the whole unit to find it. That's great. That's great. Last I knew, they were just right like in there somewhere behind those TV trays. That's great. Nope. This sucks. Oh, look. Snow in southern Kentucky. That's not normal. Why? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Yeah. Well, I've got to find this uh, space heater. Great. All right. Well, I finally found. Jeez. Oh, I found. Whoop, I found all three of them. I don't know which one's going to work best for what we need, but. We had a small one in there, and today it just stopped working all of a sudden. I don't know what that was all about, but one storage unit down. I gotta go to the other unit and get the Slim Jim, or not the Slim Jim, the Big Easy, and try to get in my nephew's little car. Well. You know, I don't just, anyways, I bet this is pretty pretty at night, pretty pretty, I bet that's pretty cool lit up at night, we'll have to come by here and check her out, look at all the fancy Christmas lights, there's an aeroplane, Look at that, and the propeller even propels, spins. It's pretty cool. There's a whole thing up in there. Well, golly, let's go take a peek. A whole little unit there. That's pretty neat, all the lights. Remember, this is cool lit up at night. We'll have to come up here and check her out. Yes, sir. There's more down there, but I'm not driving all around it. We'll come back one day at night and check her out. That's pretty neat. Yeah, so that Christmas in the Park, it's called. We'll have to come check this out one night. Well, this should be simple ish to find it's bright neon pink so we're at the other storage unit we're gonna grab the um big easy i don't have the little air pumper doodle thing so i'm just gonna have to use some screwdrivers i did find one plastic wedge so i'm hoping i don't screw the paint up too too bad uh my brother-in-law did say that he doesn't want to pay 150 dollars for a lockout so from a locksmith so just don't worry about it because i told him i said i could probably get into it but i'm probably gonna scratch the paint and he says, I don't care. I'm not paying $150 for a lockout for a locksmith to come do it. Okay. Fingers crossed, eyes crossed, nose crossed, tongue crossed, whatever, toes, everything else, that I don't shatter the window. But <clears throat> the Big Easy is long enough, and it's smooth, so it should go in pretty easy. Uh, I was trying to coat hanger last night, and I was worried about scratching the paint, so I gave up. Um, now I've got the go-ahead, so... Just gonna do the thing. I'm gonna get into it for him. Oh, 
well, you would think it'd be easy to find. Bright neon pink, but guess what I'm not seeing? Bright neon pink. I don't know where I put it. Oh, I hope I didn't bury it. So I'm up there it is. Found it. Just gonna move the bagger out of the way. I'll be able to get her. Hi everybody. Gang's all here. Hi guys, I miss you. You're gonna get ridden hard in about a month. Yeah, buddy. Any hoosin' way. I gotta get this motorcycle moved out the way and then grab that thing and then off to the house to unlock a car. So I got a newest car, no problem once I had the right tools. Uh, the big easy work, perfect. Uh, I was gonna put it on the channel, but I figured YouTube might strike me for showing how to break into a car and I don't need that drama in my life. Um, big race announcement coming up, uh, so stay tuned for that. But otherwise, uh, sorry for all the crying. I just, I thought I moved away from the snow and the cold and that wasn't the case, so. Anyways, Southern Kentucky getting snow just kind of blew my mind, but, and how cold it got. And, uh, and then we're back in the 60s in a few days. But any and way, appreciate y'all as always. Again, sorry for all the whining and crying, but I just, I'm over the cold and the snow. I moved away from Chicagoland area for a reason, right? But as always, I appreciate you guys. Big race announcement coming up. Stay tuned for that. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll catch y'all in the next one.